Hey everyone, welcome to Pipes, Tobacco, and Whiskey. So, I just recently uh, commissioned a pipe when I came back from Italy. Um, some of you know that I went to Italy this summer, and one of the things that really intrigued me was the fig shape. Um, when I was in Italy, I saw a lot of figs, real fruit figs, uh, growing on trees and stuff like that. And I thought to myself, self, the fig-shaped pipes really don't look like figs in America. They, they look more like acorns. And so when I came home, I said, you know, I'm going to have someone commission a pipe, uh, make a pipe for me that looks like an Italian fig. And so I contacted a pipe carver that I've been following since 2019, and his name is Sean Ream. Now you can find him on Facebook and on Instagram. Just look for Ream Pipes or the name Sean Ream. Uh, Ream is spelled R-E-U-M. It sounds different than the way it's spelled. Uh, and his first name, Sean, S-E-A-N. Uh, follow his work because he is awesome. Let me tell you a story about that, man. I got to uh, contact him on the 25th of September. And I told him, uh, you know, what I wanted and uh, that uh, I wanted a, a shape that reflected a real Italian fig. And so I sent him a picture of a real Italian fig and he got back to me and said, yeah, I can do that. Not a problem. Uh, let me get back to you. And so he started working on it. Now that I got a hold of him probably, oh, it was maybe 10 30 or 11 o'clock that day in the morning. He sends me a picture back that evening and tells me, Hey, I've been working on this. I shaped it out. Uh, this is 40 year old Grecian briar. Tell me what you think. Here's a picture of it. Here's actually, yeah, actually a picture and a video of it. And I couldn't believe it because it was so quick. He got to it and started working it out. Uh, it was such a such a quick response from him. Uh, and so he says, "Yeah, I'll, uh, you know, here I basically got it shaped out. I'm gonna need to put a stem on it and, and finish it and all of that." Uh, so in the next the next day, he sends me a picture uh, and a video with the stem on it. And then two days later, he, he had to take a day off from working on the pipe because he was working on cleaning up his shop. He lives in Polson, Montana. Man, you talk about a beautiful little town. It's right on Polson Lake next to Glacier Park, uh, Glacier National Park. It's beautiful up there. But anyway, uh, so he, he sends me another video on the 28th of September and says, here, it's, I, I need to oil it and then it's done. Here's a video of it. And in three days, 
I had my fig shaped pipe. Now I want to show this a little closer up close to you because uh, you know just like seeing pipes on smokingpipes.com or tobacco pipes or even these uh, pipes that artisan carvers make for you uh, pictures just not just doesn't do it justice you really have to see it up close and personal here is uh, my pipe that I wanted to show you this true fig now what I love about it is that it's got that point at the bottom and more than more than just the point at the bottom you can see the bulb kind of uh, top here that that he's put into it and then also it's got a plateau which kind of resembles uh, a top of a, of a real fig fruit uh, this is just is a dual contrast staining job uh, it's got his uh, it's got his uh, personal stamp on it I know it's difficult to see in the video Cumberland stem the videos that he sent are very good you need to make sure you watch those but this is just an awesome awesome pipe um, and it smokes wonderfully um, I strongly strongly suggest that you you uh, look him up and uh, see if you can possibly hook up a commission with him he's very affordable and super super quick uh, and it, when he mailed it to me I think I got it in three days something like that two days it was really quick uh, great great job on this pipe Sean I really do appreciate it and uh, I'm going back to get some more because his work is just that good uh, so anyway I uh, just wanted to show that off to you guys and, and uh, let you see that. And please make sure that you follow Sean on Facebook, on Instagram. Uh, he's, his uh, gallery of pictures on Instagram are all there. You can see the kind of work it, that he does. Uh, everything that I've seen has just been wonderful. Almost bought another pipe this weekend. But since the Texas show is this next weekend... I thought, well, I probably need to hold off and see how much money I spend at the Texas show. Speaking of the Texas show, boy, I sure hope I see you there. That is this Saturday, November 12th, and it's at uh, uh, Cedar Hill, uh, Texas, at Tobacco Cabana. Starts at 10 o'clock, goes until about 5 or 6 o'clock in the evening, and then, of course, afterwards, people will hang around and uh, uh, share stories and share tobaccos and things like that so i hope to see you there if, if if you are at that show please come by and say hello to me i'll probably be at the turbo tin table for a little bit i'll have some tobaccos to share with you guys uh, so come up and grab a bowl and uh, enjoy it and let me know what you think uh, so hope to see you saturday don't forget make sure that you're watching uh, sean's work especially on instagram he posts a lot of his uh, pictures on Instagram, so you're going to want to follow that. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget, make all your piping moments count. Hope you enjoyed this quick preview of my new fig, and uh, hope you have a great week. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.